Well, let's dig into this because St. Louis business owners, they're on edge after seeing their storefronts destroyed. Here now, Aboud Alhamid, a St. Louis restaurant owner whose windows were smashed in, three of them, by demonstrators Saturday night. Thank you for joining us, sir. Thank you. You know, I, I hear you're open today. The, the protests have been largely peaceful during the day, but it's at night where they're getting pretty violent. Are you closing tonight because you're worried about what might happen? Well, I am. I'm going to close around 4 o'clock or 4.30. I want all my employees to leave safely. Hopefully, it's going to be really peaceful tonight, but safe better than sorry. Yeah, you're obviously concerned um, that more damage could be done to... to your storefront to other uh, businesses in the area and of course to your employees how bad of a situation is this uh, bad of me how bad of a situation is it for you well the situation what the, when they started it was really peaceful at the end it's just getting out of control i don't know what's happened they start broking the windows and this stuff and this is the first time it's happened in in san louis this violence i've never seen it before i've been here for almost 10 years I've never seen it like this before, and hopefully it's going to be it's like just one time, that's it, and we've done with it. Yeah, here at Fox Business, we love small businesses. You're the backbone of the economy. Can you explain what kind of cost this will be to you to repair the damage and then also to be closed tonight? Well, the cost is going to be to fix this place really high. When I bring somebody, they're going to say, they say it's high dollar, but how, what's high, I don't know. Tomorrow I'm calling a contractor and they're going to give us a bit about it because they broke for me three big windows and it's really hurt small business like us. Yeah. In your opinion right now, what is really um, preventing the restoration of law and order right now? Pardon me? When do you think you you can feel safe again? What would have to happen? Well, I think today they they're gonna de demonstrate around six six thirty, and uh, as I say, it's like it's gonna be safe. People from San Luis, we've I've never seen it violent like this. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think it's gonna be it's like this time, and that's it. It's like kids did it, or somebody. It's like they don't know what they're doing. And now it's like everybody here, the community, hel helping each other. And it's like we're all in the same boat. And I think we've done with it. Yeah. Are other businesses nearby closing tonight as well? Are they in the same position as you with the same thought process here? Y yes. They are like, I think, two or three. They're closing too. And tomorrow we're going to open like n nothing going to happen. Yeah. Well, day four of protests, sir. Uh, thank you so much for your time, and good luck to you as you uh, repair that damage and open again tomorrow. Thank you.